hello folks uh, this is Tusha we are looking at Samsung Galaxy Tab 3 that is T311 it's a 8 inch tablet from Samsung that is recently launched the model is T311 uh, it is 8 inch tablet GSM plus Wi-Fi you can see the features are mentioned on the packaging itself it comes with 1.5 GB of RAM the processor is 1.5 gigahertz dual core it is a full HD playback and HD recording 1080p video recording it comes with DLNA certification that we can actually uh, broadcast pictures to the DLNA certified uh, devices. It comes with Dolby Digital Plus, uh, enhanced sound, DVX HD, powered with Android 4.2.2 Jelly Bean. And the camera is 5 megapixel. It also comes with IR LED. Uh, we can use that as a remote, universal remote control to control television sets. The price is 25,000 rupees approximately. But on Flipkart or any other uh, store, you can get it for approximately 24,000 rupees. Let's go and open this. I am not very fond of the recent packaging for this tab it's very clumsy and not very easy to use uh, but that's what we have we can have that <laughs> the tab is very good very handy it's very slim that's what I can make it from its first look it shows uh, the micro SD uh, slot uh, you can extend uh, storage uh, up to 64 GB then there is a sim card it's a micro sim card slot so you can put your sim card you can make phone calls from this tab and use 3G network or 2G network for internet data then this is uh, the headphone slot is uh, on the upper side downstairs there is a mini USB there are two speakers nicely placed for optimum Dolby sound experience then this is IR LED we can control television sets then power button and the volume buttons this is the headphone jack mm, let's go ahead and see what comes in the box the box is very tricky and not well designed I guess you can see how difficult it is to get the contents out of it it does have this nice uh, mini usb cable that we need for data transfer and uh, charging etc then this is the power adapter we can use for charging and does have oops it does have this manual um, we don't need this manual anymore because I I don't think anybody reads manuals these days okay uh, let's go ahead and see switch it on the display is nice overall um, it has that glossy back plate I I don't like at all uh, very uh, glycerin types okay the tab looks very much like their other phones you know the design is the very much the same uh, no great changes in that but the display is very clear uh, 
the tab says it has WXGA super clear LCD but looks much better than an LCD display much very close to what we have seen in AMOLED displays let's connect to the Wi-Fi uh, I, I really like this uh, uh, keyboard they have done on the tabs uh, very nicely separated keys easy to type Okay, the Wi-Fi is connected. These are the typical settings that you would want to do on a, you know, when setting up a device. Uh, you can check automatic date time from your network. Just complete the formalities. No great options here. <laughs> if you have Samsung account, connect that. If you have Google account, you will have to connected because most of the Android uh, services require you to sign in with your Google ID just type in your name to whomsoever is the tab belongs to I'm letting take zoom or if you have Dropbox you can sign in here to get 50 GB of free space okay these are the new features kind of uh, on this new tab that add up display you can see uh, you can optimize display depending upon what you are actually doing then there is one new feature in the uh, tab 3 is the add up sound I'll display that in another video let's go ahead okay here it is so the basic tab setup is complete uh, this is the main screen looks good very bright and very clear in that sense clarity is very nice you can easily put it into landscape mode very handy nice keyboard layout I, I liked it very nice see a lot of applications are pre installed on this uh, Samsung do customize the Android version they use uh, the UI is called as touch with UI on the top you get a lot of system toggles for Wi-Fi sync flight mode then power saving mode GPS mode reading this is the reading mode that is a new feature in this tab I'll show you how it works it works in specific applications probably something like with the uh, galaxy book readers the s reader you can also see many other toggles available for your tab In the settings, the setting view is little different than the smartphones. Uh, it has two column setup that we have seen from first tab itself. You can see many, uh, system, uh, you can see about device, you can go ahead and update uh, whatever the software version is available for your device. Here you can see you can use your mobile your tablet as a, a tethering device to get internet from your tablet to your PC or laptop <coughs> overall the device looks very nice very handy slim <clears throat> very good for an 8 inch tab You can also make phone calls. You can see the phone icon already there. 
you can customize your home screen lot of different options available the YouTube is installed already there is Polaris office you can open and save um, word document then there is a camera I'll be sharing you the camera quality in another video in a bit these are the settings on the camera few new modes are there night mode panorama mode sports mode auto mode a lot of these new camera modes were made available since galaxy s4 this is the peel remote you can set up your universal remote for your television here have to go through a process I, I I don't understand why India is not listed in in there <laughs> this is a group play you can also have multiple uh, applications open at the same time on this tab like you can browse on chrome at the same time or use other applications simultaneously there is this readers hub you can download books just like amazon kindle then these are multiple screens you can add widgets to Overall, I'm liking the device. Mm, with the price of 24, it's pretty fine. This is the uh, micro SD slot. I'm just uh, showing it to you. You can add up to 64 GB card. And this is the micro SIM slot. can't remove the battery uh, from the tab uh, Samsung Galaxy Tab 3 comes with a 4450 mAh battery which is very good when uh, playing games or watching movies this is the ripple effect or light effect on the lock screen you can change that from the settings i showed you and that's about it i think this is a great tab if you have any questions feel free to ask in comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for latest updates thank you